Ali taking the stuff back. This guy is a monster. This has been one of my most highly anticipated matches of the card. Did you get us kicked off the show yet? I don't think so. That was quite an outburst in intermission. You don't get it. You couldn't regulate these people. I got them back for intermission. Let's focus on the match. So, not you much of yourself a... the regulator? This is 1997. Well, in all seriousness, it's Prince Akhenaten, not Prince Akhenaten like you were trying to tell me before. That came out of the pronunciation of every single wrestler that I have the book, volume number six. I think you guys should just watch and admire royalty. Well, right now, the benchmark Bill Daly, he's not gonna bow down to any man. He's actually telling him, punch me in the face, bro. Oh, and he did, he gets first blood. Bill Daly returns the receipt. He doesn't understand culture. He doesn't understand royalty. I Other spent time on the road with Bill Daly. This man is one of the most intense athletes I have ever whoa, met in my whoa, entire whoa. life. What do you mean you spent time on the road with him? <laughs> Traveling from town to town, brother. Something yeah. you don't know about. That's right. Doing a little hike on Brokeback Mountain. Oh, roaring elbow from Bill Daly. 2006 jokes here, folks. Well, that's the last time any of us see the announcing here, but that's we true. still are timeless, brother. That's why you guys are here. I might be new, new to the company, but I'm certainly here to stay. You know, folks, I hope you're back at home when you're watching this DVD. You press the mute button when that shrivelly voice comes on. <laughs> DVDs? This is VHS courtesy of Coliseum Home Video. What are you talking about? <laughs> right here. Prince Akhenaten. Bill Daly. No relation to the Vice President of the National Hockey League, also by the same name. This guy's over here talking about hockey. Bill Daly is making the Prince a permanent part of that railing. Has this referee heard of a count out? These guys have been out there for over 25 seconds. Yeah, they're basically living out there. Right? That's a lie, because you can't count to 25. <laughs> Double A told me that as a fact. He would never say that. That's true. And I would never lie. Except when you do. I wonder what his king thinks about his prince tonight. And right now, Bill Daly, infuriated here. This is no kind of royalty that he will ever bow down to. Bill Daly in the corner. He goes for the big boot, but. That's right. Very smart. I cannot. And that's how you break a man's leg, potentially. That is very smart. Ground him and pound him. Definitely a ground and pound approach and wedging that leg in the bottom turnbuckle never hurts a bit, let me tell you. Well, that's what I'm talking about. You're finally counting when somebody's outside. You know, it's not only on announcing with a door chop, but you can leave the door chop as well. And now, Bill Daly gets in a rare outburst, gets outsmarted here from the Prince. Well, that's royalty right there. Royalty always has the brains. That's right, and the upper hand. Bill Daly was preaching to the front row earlier, asking if they were tired of this hokey gimmick. Well, right now, the Prince is showing them that it's not a gimmick, but it's a way of life. It is a lifestyle indeed. Just like your alternative lifestyle, Adams. We embrace that too. Anyway, we're going to focus on the wrestling. Well, that, that's about time. Absolutely asinine. That's what double A stands for. For the cover, one, two. Oh, I see the David Adams toilet paper has arrived on the table. Oh, yeah, look at that. He'll even autograph it for you. 
Hey, if somebody wants it, go. And now, Bill Daly in a whole lot of trouble as the Prince has focused on his body part. The turning point in this match was right where Daly went to give him a kick into the corner, and the Prince moved out of the way and started smashing that leg, and he's been working on that leg ever since, guys. They're chanting, shave your back. You know, that's disrespectful. The Prince being here is the second best thing to happen to Toto this week. What's the first best thing? Flushing toilets. You are obsessed with toilet flushing. Are you a plumber? Oh, working that leg. Smart, and smart. And Prince Akonaton. That is a veteran move. And he's trying to use the ropes. Finally, the referee is doing something. As this action continues, I'm joined by Mark Zim and I'm joined by Double A. That's right. I know his Get his name right. When you think about great arenas, you think MSG, you think the Tokyo Dome, and you think the Elks Lodge in Totoa. Um, it's great to be here, Mr. Adams. For the cover! Is this ring gonna hold up with such action? Absolutely, positively. Right now, is Bill Daly's knee gonna hold up through this match is the main question I think everybody's wondering what we're right about now. Shades of an Egyptian magician. <laughs> the Egyptian magician. Bill Daly is about as cold as Gordy Howe right now. Uh, dude, too soon. <laughs> too soon. It just happened. Game. Oh, you guys, rest in peace to two of the greatest athletes that ever lived. As this actually continues here, and Prince Akonaton, he just gets the royal jewels caught up on that top turnbuckle. He, he likes it? Hey, those Egyptians are into some wacky stuff. Yeah. Bill Daly's into beating up people. Kicking butt and taking names. He claims that he is the benchmark to what all wrestlers now, should hold a standard dangerous. to. This is the most dangerous move, especially in this arena. So is your commentary, but yes, this move is very dangerous. Especially that light fixer. Eventually, Daly's gonna quit. Well, that has not happened tonight. There has not been a submission. Did you know that, David Adams? I did, that there has not been any submissions tonight. Brutal, brutal move. The benchmark is wins it. I'll call that an upset. Back. Look, Prince had him that whole match. It's a royal victory, but a royal victory by the benchmark, Phil Kelly. <laughs> Through the sands of time, all we are is dust in the wind, dude. He wants gold. He wants that BBWF World Heavyweight Championship that sits in front of us. We're 